<laughs> you get the tickets? Who needs two? Oh, Mama Cita. <laughs> Special sneak preview of Death Blow. Death Blow. When someone tries to blow you up, not because of who you are, but because of different reasons altogether. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Right. Run up. Hey, Jerry, you think you can get an extra ticket for my friend Brody? Grammy, you know what I had to go through to get these? Yeah, I know, but he's a big fan of the genre. You know, I'd consider it a personal favorite to me. <laughs> yeah, I guess I do. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, listen, you want me to stay here till George gets up? No, I'm okay. There's no problem, really. I'm fine. We have a show business is here. Oh, there's Brody. Brody, over here. Hey, Kramer. Yeah. And uh, you must be Jerry. Thanks for the ticket. It's quite a feedback you're working on there. <laughs> it's for all of us. Is there a problem? Yeah, Brody. Brody, come on, he's just kidding. He's a joke maker. Tell him, Jerry. I'm a joke maker. <laughs> All right, here we go. Death blow. Hey. Hmm. What the hell is he doing? Relax, he does that all the time. Does what? He's making a copy of the movie for sale on the street. Hmm? May I see you outside for a moment, please? Come on, I want to watch Outside! <laughs> Come on! Are you bootlegging the movie? But it's a perfectly legitimate business. It's not legitimate. It's a business. Where did you meet this guy? Well, he's a friend of a friend. You know Corky Rammer is up on 94th Street? One day he and I are playing pachinko. Kramer! <laughs> in the death blow. <laughs> I don't believe it. Are you okay? Oh, I got a cramp. Well, it's no wonder you ate that entire bag of candy. Oh, and there it goes again. Uh, Kramer, you gotta drive me home. Hey, what is going on over here? Jerry, finish shooting the movie for me. Are you nuts? There is no way I'm holding that thing. Jerry. The man is in pain. Yeah, well, maybe if he didn't lick his fingers before he reached in the bag, we would have eaten some. Serves him right. Are well, you some kind of tough guy? Okay, let's everybody just relax. <laughs> Jerry, take the camera. All right, I'm, I'm taking the camera. All right, come on, let's go. Thanks. I remember every oh, man. <laughs> So how was the rest of death blow? How was the rest of death blow? Yeah, who got the final death blow? Because I thought that Hawaiian guy, he had it coming to him, huh? Kramer, you make me get a ticket for this friend of yours, and then the guy forces me to bootleg a movie at gunpoint? He's quite a character, isn't he? You know, he came by here last night, 3 o'clock in the morning, to pick up the tape. I was scared out of my mind. Okay. Yep. Brody. Yeah, come on up. It's Brody. He's gone. What? Are you crazy? I don't want to see this guy again. Look, Jerry, you did him a favor. He probably wants to come up and thank you. What if I didn't do it right? Well, it's your first time. He'll understand. People with guns don't understand. That's why they get guns. Too many misunderstandings. Hey, Brody. Hi. Jerry, I have to talk to you about the tape. Yeah. I've never seen such beautiful work. What? You're a genius. The zoom-ins, the framing. I was enchanted. Well, to the best I could. I got another project for you. It's a movie called Cry Cry Again. I was going to give it to one of my other guys, but it's an arty movie, and quite frankly, they don't have the sensibility. Uh, may I use your phone? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's uh, under the couch. Look at you. You got another gig, huh? I don't want another gig. I'm not doing this. But you have a gift. Look, Jerry, this is not your little comedy act. We're talking feature films here. We're talking <laughs> federal crime here. I'll expect that tape by 3 o'clock tomorrow. Uh, may I borrow this, please? Yeah, yeah sure. Oh, you need a glove? Nah. 